What's up YouTube, C7 Walker. Um, before I start this video on top 15 best city of tweaks 2011 through 2012. Um, to get all these sources, I mean get all these apps and tweaks for free, you will need to download, I mean, add the repo, which is this right here. Put my phone out the way. Add this repo. HTTP. Make sure to subscribe. So yeah, there's that repo. And now let's get started on top 15 best city tweaks. In my opinion. <coughs> Alright, first we have Gridlock. Gridlock. What Gridlock does is put your icons in a place where they can go wherever they want. See, put that right there, that right there, that right there, right there, put it anywhere they want. Usually, usually they'll just go to the spot right behind the next one. So they just fill in right there, and that was just filling right there, and just so on. Which, that's kind of lame. Because I like it like that. So yeah, just gridlock, G-R-I-D-L-O-C-K. And second we have Android Lock XT. Android Lock XT. What this does is add a Android type theme to when you unlock it. And enter your passcode. And manage all this stuff in settings. How to change it. I'm sure most of y'all have it, but change pattern, change appearance, all that stuff. And then third we have, and that's, how you, that's how you spell it, by the way. And then third we have, I mean, yeah, third we have App Center, which gives you like a, when you open your uh, notification center, um, puts your favorite apps, what you select, at the top so you can access them access them very easily just like that and you just you can pick and choose the ones you want you can all apps I don't like that you can just choose your apps like that so fourth we have barrel which barrel is I'm probably sure most of y'all have it again but barrel just gives you a, a scrolling thing when you slide to new pages it just scrolls really cool and smooth I'm on Pac-Man right now. I like that one the best. But there's other ones you can do, like Page Squeeze, which I don't like this one. It just kind of goes in and out. And then Icon Scatter. Like that. And yeah, I'll change it back to Pac-Man. <coughs> on number five, we have Brightness switcher which is adds a second instead of just a volume being there adds a brightness to it too when you uh, multitask and you can change it so it's just brightness which I don't like that at all so I'll just change it back so yeah just get that it's pretty cool I like it it's useful um, this one the uh, Sixth one on the list is Cascade, which gives you a look at the bottom. Like this, like a cover flow look. See how it's, it's kind of popping, up, popping out. And you scroll, it goes up. It's kind of cool. I like it. And you can access this. You can turn it off and on. You can hide the labels. So only the top, that one right and the one in the middle will show. The other ones are hidden. I like that off. You can set the angle of it, so I just turn that right there. Hold on. Settings. So it's kind of moved a different way. Turn it all the way down. I like mine on default. It looks better. Yes. It don't matter where you put this. So I'll try to show you that one more time. It's pretty cool. <coughs> um, 
On number seven, we have color keyboard, which gives you a keyboard that you can color and customize and make pop 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 up keys, not just white. Um, it's pretty cool. I like it. Um, you can access and edit everything in settings. Customize the backgrounds. Pick a background and put it in the middle. The color of it and everything. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, next up, it's not really like a... Well, it is kind of like a tweak, but it runs in the background. Like, whenever you download an app from Cydia, Cydia and you can't delete it, you have to delete it off of iTunes. Just, um, I mean, off of your computer, just... Um, all you have to do is hold it like a regular one, and it'll uh, delete it. You can just delete it. See, that one's from uh, Cydia. Install this is from Skit Cydia. And all this is from Cydia, mostly. <clears throat> and I can delete them. Um, so, yeah, that's uh, Side Elite, S Y D E L E T. And then, number nine, we have InfiniDoc. Which gives you a scrolling at the bottom, at the dock, instead of just being just four. Let's do that. And you can just edit all this in settings, item, items for page. You can go up to 10, you can go down to 1. I like mine on 5 because it matches my springboard. Now there's 5. So yeah, just, that's pretty cool too. Also, I say I say that a lot, but who cares? Um, all these tweaks are cool. Um, uh, number uh, ten, we have open backup, and what this does is if your iPhone ever messes up, um, and you have to restore it, just restore it before. But you have to back it up before you restore it to get all the things you had from city on here so like you just click back up and it'll back it up and lots backing up and then like after you back it up whenever it crashes or just something and it says it's backed up um so whenever you have to restore it this will be on here after we restore it so just go on to it and then you click restore and then all your stuff flows on Cydia will be on there again so yeah it's pretty useful um, at number t 11 we have Vexilum Vexilum which this is is whenever you get a text and notification slides from the top and I'll send myself a text real fast after it real fast You can change the colors of it. Mine's green and ye green and yellow. And change the text, uh, color, and every everything. Um, that is Vexilum. You just do everything in settings. You can change the border of it, font color, banner color, all that stuff. And that number. 12 we have we roll which is what we roll do is it's from a uh, barrel but it's from for your notification center see how it slides and does all that cool stuff you can just be like pull down and it just slides down with it outer cube and all that stuff i like spiral the best so that's we roll from cydia and then uh, at number 13, we have Winter Board, which everybody probably has Winter Board. You can just select your themes and all this stuff. Then you just respring. Um, yeah, it's pretty basic. Man, there ain't nothing I'll explain right there, but um, yeah, that's Winter Board. And then at number 13, we have Five Column Spring Board, which gives you five across and five down. And four down. Instead of just having four across and four down, it has five. So I kind of like that. And it's spelled five and then, well, not the number five, just you probably know how to spell five and then a slash and then 
column C O L U M N and then space spring board. And then at number 14 we have install us, which install us does is the app that you go into. You know, search for any app you want and you can get them all for free instead of having to buy them off the app store. So let's say Angry Birds. Angry Angry Birds. You know, search. Right there. Just click on it. Click download. And, um. Like media fire. You just click on any of these you want, then HJ, and just type in all this stuff HJ 6Q. Make sure I'm not a robot. And click submit, and then it'll direct you to a page where you have to download it from. So it load. Click download. And it says started. You go over here to downloads. It's right there. And once you get it, once it downloads, you just install it, and I'll show you all that here in a little while. After I uh, go over a couple more things. Well, actually, this is my last one. Hello. LOL, laugh out loud. Um, so I'll just come back to that later. I'll just talk about some more stuff. Um, so, this is the iPhone 4 running on Verizon CDMA. I'll show you. And it's on iOS 5.0.1. And the notification center, we row, has to be on 5.0 I mean and above. So, iPhone 4. CDMA iOS 5.0.1 Cydia 1.1.3 or 1.1.3. Um, so yeah, so I have all that. Let's see if this thing's done downloading. Almost has about 30 seconds remaining. Um, what I haven't gone over, like what I didn't put in the top 15, is like. Um, well, I don't know. Like, I think I I skipped one thing because it's really not a tweak. I didn't do Spire because I don't like this at all. I just can't get it off. It won't let me get it off for some reason. It's like for Siri, but you have to have a proxy, proxy server and you have to buy them and crap. So I don't like doing it. So I just don't use it. Um, all their stuff I used on this video and so yeah all right see it's downloaded you just click on it and you click install let it load just for a second it only take about 10 seconds hold on there's a text message i can't like i'll read Let that install, and it says installed, so it should be my home screen right there. Angry Birds, and it fully works. Just go to it, and it works. So, yeah, that's the top 15 best city of tweaks. Uh, make sure su to subscribe and comment and rate, and I'll do another video pretty soon. So I guess for the time being, etc. Peace.